I need to turn the beam a few degrees uh, for him. Right. Good afternoon. We're out for the Sunday DX on the British. Um, <clears throat> smells on the air uh, weekend. This weekend, so I brought uh, two meters with me. I've uh, called into a station this morning, but I was uh, mobile, so didn't uh, quite make it. And uh, I've got a. Got to try this out on the net today. Uh, very kindly uh, given me last week, <coughs> so I'm going to be uh, trying that. Going to have to run it off the uh, power pack though. Pretty battery fit at the minute, but um, yeah, like I say, PMR's going at the minute. Best seven threes and thanks to the five and three or whatever it was, so. That's a station in Swindon. But, um, yeah, like I say, uh, out for the uh, net in a bit there. And uh, yeah, it's not a bad day actually, the day is a bit. Oh, shut up, it's a bit windy. But uh, apart from that, all good. Right. Uh, that's about it for now, so uh, catch you in a bit. Okay, yeah, just had a few uh, reports off this. It's, uh, yeah, it seems to be working well, so I'm going to call into the net with this and see how it goes. And um, it was uh, literally zero signal both ways, gone up to uh, Borough Beacon. Uh, so, uh, so happy with that one. But uh, I'll go quiet for a minute, Sid. Uh... Don't know what you're doing up there. Yeah, I'll go it, Sid. Any copy now, Roger? Yeah, got you now, Mark. No signal there, radio free. Yeah, Roger, Sid, Roger. I'm using that handheld, that handheld there, Roger. Oh, the one I gave you. Yeah, Roger said, Roger, that's the one. <laughs> Did you put batteries in it or using it outside? Was it 9 volts or 12? Come to think of it, I think it might have been 12, was it? Yeah, Roger said uh, 12 volt, yeah, I've uh, I've got it running off my um off my little uh, starter pack there. I've got that in my pocket and uh, just using the handheld said I thought I'd give it a blast. <laughs> yeah, they've got Blake uh, uh, Knowledge there, I think that sounded like Dark Made of Coal there, M10 Coal. Yeah, did you have it open, Mark? Yeah, copy, Mark. Yeah, good afternoon there, Carl. Uh, yeah, I did uh, just uh, get a report off you on the, uh, off the 1-9 there. Didn't realise who it was, mate, but um, yeah, got you no problem at all there. Roger, Roger. Um, a few motocross bikes going past there. But uh, yes, uh, Sid uh, kindly donated it last week, so I thought I'd give him a run this week. And uh, yeah, it seems to be pretty good. Uh, fair play there, Carl. I thought I'll try out uh, different. Made it out onto the plane this afternoon, mate. Yeah, Roger. Yeah, I was determined to get up here today. Oh. I haven't failed to get anyone yet with this. Just got the uh, Salisbury plane. I hope this wind is going to spoil this video. Last night, uh, got home stupid o'clock, uh, went to bed, mate, and. Uh... Raider, give Ray a shout up on the clears. Yeah, copy, Ray. Yeah, copy, mate. Uh, got yep. you on the seven, uh, high ground, uh, Langhorse. I just got uh, through the way on Clee Hill as well. So, <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty good, that, isn't it? Somebody else up there, you could hear, but uh, I've got the same ones as you've got, so I doubt if you can. Yeah, uh, Seth, there was Saddleworth about two o'clock. Two o'clock, there was Saddleworth, a chap called Andy trying to get in. Okay, key up to you there, uh, Malcolm. 
Congleton there uh, at night. Shall I save you and bring him in? Yes, Adleworth, Andy, if you're still there, mate, said uh, Charlie Tango 141's returning to you. Ah, right, just nipped in the car for a bit of a warm, this, uh, getting a bit, <laughs> getting a bit chilly out there. I said, um, Saddleworth has got a contact on you before, but he's got some interference at the minute, so he'll come back to you in a few minutes, then. Yeah, OK, was well, taken in, but not on that first queue, so there's still a few out there. They'll come back to that one, I think. OK, we'll just be a couple more in, because it's getting very busy down here. I ain't getting a chance to pass anyone around. But anyone else out there want to come back to 141, Charlie Tango, High Ground, Berkshire Downs. Uh, Richard, down in Cardiff. Sorry, Richard, I don't want to get you mad up that bloke called Tony himself. <laughs> down in Cardiff there. Yeah, we got you there. Not bad to the Berkshire Downs there, uh, Richard. Yeah, it's just nice to be able to get out again for a change. Oh, you're out about, are you? I am, yes. Um, I've, we, have, we have spoken before. It's uh, just been a while. Yeah, OK, no problem. Station there. Yes. Saddleworth Mall. Taking your Andy about Radio Free. Come back to the Berkshire Downs, Andy. I did it anyway. Unfortunately. We may, <clears throat> we may have a special guest uh, appearance uh, shortly. We'll have to uh, see how it goes. Les in Spain, he is coming through. Okay, let's see what we can do. So we can salvage something for this great list we have there. Oh dear. Let's try, um, let's have a look there. Not sure if we will. Oh, let's go back to the Isle of Wight. Not the Isle of Wight. Uffington White Hall's there. Landing the Lady, or is it uh, Chris there? Anyone, anyone you want to shout for, you guys, on the Uffington White Horse? Next to Bart up on the British here. Oh, that's it. I'm sure I made a note of it somewhere. No, I didn't. Yeah. Okay, I thought someone said there's someone. Mr. Tom, uh, up on the Quantrox, Roger. Yeah, okay. Could you hear anything there you'd like to have a shout for there, uh, Tony? No, I've been listening in, mate. I can hear them all. If Tom can speak to them, so can I. <laughs> QSL. Yeah, the, the Charlie Tango call sign is CT2034. It's the same 34 on the end, but uh, 2034. So, uh, so it's easy for me to remember. Never mind anybody else there, said Roger. Yeah, OK. 2034, right? Yeah, Roger, Roger. Yeah, OK. Anyone you want to shout for there, Tony? Could you hear anybody? OK, we have got um, Kevin have joined us. Um, Charlie Tango 146. Uh, that was pretty good one. I never remember that. <laughs> but um, yeah, so uh, Kevin's uh, joined us now, and uh, I know Gareth is trying to uh, get up here. We haven't seen uh, I've seen Gareth for months there. So with a bit of luck, you'll be up after. But I know he was in the house having a roast dinner, so uh, that probably involves a pint. So we're not all going to hold our breath on that one. But um. Yeah, good net uh, so far. Really, really busy and uh, loads calling in there. But, um, yeah, some pretty good ones there uh, calling in. Right, uh, catch you in a bit. Oh, what a surprise, yeah, we've got Gareth and... Gary104. Oh yeah, full uh, full house, uh, full crew again today there. Good afternoon, uh, Gary. 
a little bit more often now, mate. Um, might make even make the uh, midweek net a little bit more often now, Mark. It's been too long, mate. That's you. <laughs> Yeah, that's it. It's like uh, starting again there now, Gary. <laughs> and uh, yeah, it'll be uh, be nice to get you uh, back out there. Um, I have got a little uh, a little stranger uh, with me uh, myself there, but um, <laughs> yeah, I'm called in. Yeah, pretty well doing a minute. Yeah, okay there, Gary. Um, yeah, cracking job. And um, Gary Lloyd, I think you said you were. Lloyd, um, it's just over 2,000 feet, mate. I think I think it's um, the last 2,000 foot peak in the Bracken Beacons before all sorts of uh, withers away to nothing as you get into West Wales, mate. That's it. Okay, bacon time. Trying to shelter from the wind. I have um, the new pouches have turned up, so I've got a full uh, a full set of Weber name, more than a full set actually. I'm quite lucky I put on a bit of weight so I can get some more pouches on the belt because it's bigger. <laughs> but um, yeah, we'll go through that. Uh, probably do that now when I get back home. Do that video, so I haven't forgot. But um, yeah, cracking. Nice to hear a uh, few stations out there. Gary 104 up on Garrig. And uh, Gareth has uh, finally made to get it out. Okay, that's the uh, net uh, over and done with there. So we've uh, put away just monitoring uh, two meters at the moment, but uh, unusually it's a bit quiet. Uh, I haven't put any calls out yet though. But uh, we'll show it to go. Anyway, um, yeah, cracking, uh, cracking net. Good to you, uh, Gary104. And uh, nice to see Gareth again there. Uh, we was just talking now with the amber out since the, uh, before Christmas. Yeah, that's been uh, quite a while. Uh, anyway, I think uh, that's going to be about it for now. Um, anything else I'll add on to the end as always there. And I will do that uh, video uh, of the web in, uh, in a separate video uh, this evening there. Uh, tomorrow at the latest. Right, anyway, I'm off. We're off. Uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for the contacts. And uh, bye for now. Uh, 7 3.